So what's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, yeah, the dude I source worked the child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fool's heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fool's heads, it's asshole's heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planting lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new Mollus, sort of a super Mollus, and it's called Priapolds. It's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA. Now, he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Krastenberg Hotel in Richmond. Of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using Mollus, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man, all right, fuck it, I got you. I thought that you would. Now... Consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs. You know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm gonna make the investment. We don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone. Of course, you pretend to be happy, because you say you have all the answers. You're selling people hope. Well, buddy, hope is a lie. I figured out all the answers, <laughs> and believe me, life is a dark, horrible chasm of despair, punctuated by brief moments where you get beer and breasts. So, so trust me, people, <laughs> you do not hope to be like this cult dude. Children of the Mountain is not a cult or a religion. We don't believe in anything. We are a personal development community, using our unique knowledge of human spirituality and development to put you in touch with your true dimension in stages for a price. What do you mean, Brother Adrian? What I mean is this. Through literally weeks of dedicated study, I've discovered the secret to realizing human potential, convention, and seminar revenue, and utilizing completeness. I can make you and I can make the you that you are the best you in the whole galaxy of potential yous that are there. Life's a competition. It's a competition with yourself. Well, that's a competition you can win. And I will show you how. <laughs> Dude, I have eight ways of not understanding this. Is this like a 12-step a program? Why do people that quit doing stuff always have to tell everyone else? You know, I quit typing in Granny Wants It Bad into search engines. Let's move it out, people! We need this area clear!
Keep your eye out for anything unusual. Man, you get what you give out, Mr. Lowry. We got a shooter! Take cover! 